losing a true love. Bob, I think that's a lie. Bob, I think that's a lie. Hello guys, it's me Tori and welcome back to my channel for another video in The Sims 4. I know, it's been ages since I've done videos. Been very stressed recently, but it's fine because we're back and we're making a Valentine's Day video with the iconic Bob and Eliza pancakes. Now, I don't know if you know this or not, but these two, they have a very, very, very bad relationship. They're kind of iconic because of how bad their relationship is. Um, there's a lot of tea with this relationship. And I just went in and made it worse because it's Valentine's Day. Love day. And I just thought I'd cause some drama. <laughs> so as you can see right now, they're kind of enemies, but they're lovers. To be in love is such a beautiful thing. Uh, they literally hate each other. It's fine. I mean, if they're together and they're in a relationship, there's hope for all us single people yet. So anyway, as it's Valentine's Day, I thought for once and for all, I would go in and I would fix Bob and Eliza's marriage because that is a nice thing. I mean, poor Eliza Pancakes. People give her a lot of hate. She d Does she deserve it? Possibly. Have I given her a lot of hate before? Yes. And am I sorry about that? No. But it's fine. We're gonna fix her up and we're gonna fix her marriage because it's Valentine's Day and I feel like being nice. But I mean, if they're really gonna fix their marriage, um, Eliza really needs a makeover. So that's what we're gonna do. You know what? This. I think this might be Eliza Pancake's best form. I think this is a good look for her, don't you think? Okay, so I don't think I'm gonna give Bob a makeover because, I mean, let's just face it, he's not that bad and also I don't know how to dress male sims so I don't want to dress a male sim and just make him look ten times worse. But he doesn't look too bad. But Eliza, EA did her dirty. I feel bad for her, you know? She's she's not having the best time, is she? I mean, look at that. Look at that. Look at those flip-flops. Look at those jeans. Who wears jeans with flip-flops? I mean, she's got like some weird kind of beachy outfit going on, but it's not. I, I, I don't know. She's got some Karen hairstyle going on. Like, sis, what's happening to you, mate? Right. So, I mean, glasses. I don't think I have any good glasses. And I want to give her glasses because I don't want to suddenly completely drastically change her. I mean, she doesn't need to not wear glasses to look pretty or anything. But I just don't have any good glasses. And my computer's glitching out, which I'm sorry about. But I'm sorry, sweetie. Those glasses have got to go. You don't look good with them. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going for here. I don't know, I like this one. She can get cute ombres with that. Anne, I think she looked kind of cute with like some ombre hair thingy. You know, she needs like an ombre moment. This is her chance to shine. Look at that. Oh. Sis is a queen. She likes green, yeah? How about some green? Ugh, I, I can't do it to her. I mean, that's kind of cute. She, she can look like that. I love that eyeliner though. That looks so cute. If I could do my eyeliner like that, like honestly, I, I would become a beauty guru. Okay shadows yeah she can get shadow for everyday look so this is a queen right what about a bold yellow look i don't know i'm kind of feeling a bold yellow look kind of nice but i don't know if she can pull it off <gasps> purple oh she looks like the jeffree star bloodlust palette that's what it looks like does it not remind you of that cute i like it yeah we, we can be inspired by that okay Sis, it's time we sort out your clothes. Your wardrobe is kind of looking a little bit tired, not gonna lie. We kind of need to, you know, just clean up your act a bit. Right, what is wrong with my game today? I'm gonna scream and rage quit The Sims 4. A lot of people, they don't like plum bobs in The Sims 4 because it kind of breaks like the third wheel. Third wheel? Is that the right, is that what I'm trying to say? The third wall, the fourth wall. Third wheel? I don't know. I'm pretty sure <laughs> the third wheel is not the right thing. I know it's Valentine's Day, but that is not what I'm trying to say. <laughs> the fourth wall, I think, is what I'm trying to say. I'm pretty sure. Someone please help me. You know what? 
Be a bit more confident, hun. You know, show your legs. I mean, I would never do this, but my Sims can. Look at that. Look. Oh, she, she mm, I think she looks good. I don't really know how I feel about long sleeve tops and shorts because I'm like, well, is it cold or is it not cold? Is you're wearing a long sleeve top because it's cold, but you're wearing shorts because it's hot. So which is it? I know it's a bit weird, but like, that's my thoughts on that. I can't be bothered to do any more of her outfits. I'm not, I don't know. I don't know if I can be bothered. I mean, is that enough effort? You know what? Just gonna say that it is. It's fine. There we go. See Eliza. You're looking a lot better, sweetie. I mean, you're looking a lot younger now. I mean that's that's good. Um I think before you were kind of going for like grandma chic, maybe. I mean, no offense to the people who voted the granny chic stuff pack for the knitting themed community stuff pack. I mean, to be fair, I was one of those people who voted for the granny chic and I was kinda salty about it, not gonna lie, but we're gonna let it slide. Eliza is our granny chic. So if we're really gonna fix this marriage between Bob and Eliza, we can't stay here. How are you gonna have a good marriage if you live here? Like how are you gonna do it? How are you gonna have a good marriage if you live in this place? You're just gonna be sad and you're just gonna argue with each other because you think, well how the heck did I end up here? Is my life really that bad? Maybe I should get divorced and let you keep the house. Seriously, I'm not being nice to you. I'm not gonna like this house not a good house so i think it's just time they moved okay so they're here this is what they spent their life savings on i mean they kind of didn't because they got loads left where's all this money coming from like you're so entitled and you got all this money and all these opportunities but you still like decide to dislike each other i mean wow i mean they're getting on really well anyway and you know, uh, when you're not getting on very well anyway, I mean, maybe a tiny home isn't the best idea. I mean, they probably need some space from each other, but you know what? Maybe a tiny home can really make them appreciate their differences and they can just kind of be forced to live in a small confined space. I mean, I'm pretty sure this already counts as a tiny home, but I mean, it's ugly. Look at this. Residential, tiny home residential. Are you kidding? This is over 100 tiles. Tiny homes are tiny. Duh. Right. We're going to get rid of some of this like patio space. We don't need this. Oh, this is just sinfully ugly. I mean, it's Valentine's Day. Red. Love. But ugh, it looks horrid. It's, it's sinfully ugly. I'm so sorry about this. This isn't good. Okay. I'm sorry about this. I don't know what this is. I was going for entitled and then it just went stupid. I mean, there's literally gold tables next to yellow flowers on trees. There's gold pillars. <laughs> when you get inside, it's a lot worse. Literally, you don't think it can get worse. It can get a lot worse. <laughs> it literally got a lot worse. Look at that. Why did I do this? Someone take me away from The Sims 4, please. Please. I've had a rough week, okay? It's not my fault. And then the bathroom. It, it's just a gold mess, basically. It, it's not good. Um, <laughs> but this is Bob and Eliza's house, you guys. They still have loads of money left, which, I mean, could be good. Also, I'm obsessed with making houses on a hill. Don't know why. Wow, really blends in with that house, doesn't it? Looks exactly the same. Look at that. Wow, the the similarities between these two houses, just uncanny. But we got a tier three tiny home, so we got a lot of benefits to living here. Oh, look, your chair's gonna get wrecked. Oh, no, Bob, don't. Oh, for goodness sake. No, don't, no. No, you can't die. This is ridiculous. Bob. Bob Pancakes. Don't you dare die. <laughs> That's great. I think maybe we should have like a dinner party or something. That would be fun. 
He could have like a whole Valentine's Day dinner party. Mm, let's go on a date with her. Yeah, Bob Pancakes, go on a date with her. Bob and Eliza need to go on a date to sort their marriage. Where are they going to go on a date? Oh, the beach. Yeah, that's a nice place to go on a date. Wow, this is way too early to be at a beach. I mean, it's kind of a nice beach though. Flirt with her, Bob. Go on. See, she looks a lot better now. I mean, you didn't need to glow up. She needed a glow up. Oh, no! <gasps> what are you doing? Don't mock... Oh, Bob, that is low. That is low. She glowed up and you mock her outfit. <gasps> now she's embarrassed. Bob! Oh, my God. Bob Pancakes! You're a savage. I don't like you. That's not very nice. Who's this mermaid person? I think she's a mermaid, isn't she? Yeah. Hi. I, I like her. <gasps> she's making a sandcastle. Oh, she's wearing yellow. Oh, she needs to be... I think we're going to have a dinner party. And she needs to be invited to our dinner party. Purely based on the fact she's wearing yellow. I like her. She's good. Okay. Bob! Why do you keep being horrible? They're being horrible to each other. These pancakes. They need my help. They need me to fix their marriage. They're not doing well. I was here trying to make some wholesome Valentine's Day content. And they're out here arguing. It's not fun. Wait, why is she shouting at us? This girl. The nerve of this girl. This is horrible. Why are we being offensive to each other? Why are we being offensive to each other? Apologise, Eliza. This, I was trying to be wholesome here. I was making stupid yellow tiny homes, trying to fix their marriage, and they're out here shouting. What's going on? Bob, you need to apologise to that woman of yours instant, okay? Blow her a kiss. I'm sure she'll love it. Yeah, oh, okay. She's forgiven you. That's fine. Oh, <laughs> she's like, nah, I'm not having that. Oh my god. <laughs> this is not a good date. This is. Now he's embarrassed. They're both embarrassed. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> oh, he's he's up for it. There's no bed. We can fix that. Um, bed. Why have I put it here? This is stupid. There's no way to put it inside. Okay. Apologise. It's just a simple apology. It's fine. Oh, he's like, no? Oh, no! Okay. 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 Maybe you didn't want to joke that mermaid girl was here. Oh, this... If someone comes in, this is awful. I mean, comes in. Comes in where? They're outside. They're literally outside. No, why did I... Why did I do this? Oh, no. <laughs> How's her relationship with Bob going? <laughs> they still hate each other. Ew, that doesn't look like chicken. What is that? Ew. Okay, that's chicken. I was going to say... That's chicken with sweet corn. And you're telling me that's grilled chicken? That looks like a baguette. That looks like a baguette. I'm sorry, is that a chicken? No, I don't like that. That looks that looks gross. The date's nearly over. Oh no. Oh no. This is such a bad date. Wait, talk to Bob. 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 Embrace him. Oh, that wasn't socializing. Ah, unsuccessful date. No. Oh. Someone's passed out here. Oh, no. That was a great date. Loved that. We're miserable. Someone's doing random push-ups on the ground. Bob's eating the food. We're not eating the food. Why aren't we eating the food? I don't know. Bob's still in his dressing gown. It's all a hot mess. Where's my grilled chicken? <gasps> She's wearing yellow. Hey, you want to come to our party? Okay. You want to come to our party? Yeah? Nice. Okay, well since that date was unsuccessful, I think we need to go to the city. Because there's two things I want to do in the city. I want to meet some more friends for my dinner party. 
and I also um I want to learn how to make a certain type of food as well. Okay, why don't we try and fix their marriage a little bit? You know, sis, you're gonna, I don't know, whisper seductively. This, they're, they're doing well. I think they can really sort out their differences if they try hard enough. Okay. Oh no! <laughs> Ouch! He literally threw her! Did you see that? He literally threw her. Oh my god. Smooth recovery. Yes. Okay. See, I said the pancakes were really bad for each other. I feel like there's just like some written in-game code. No, Bob, have you wet yourself? Oh, Bob. That's not romantic. <laughs> I mean, if Bob's relationship's not going to work out with Eliza, um, we can always maybe flirt with this woman. I really don't want him to do this. <laughs> this is not what I planned. Right, who's one of these runners? I mean, if Bob's relationship with Eliza ain't going so well, um, I mean, we've got this guy. Makoa. I mean, if his relationship ain't working out with Eliza, maybe he should just move on, you know? Oh, hey, what's up? You literally got the same hat. <laughs> I can imagine Bob with that hair. I think it'd be good for him. Look how stinky he's making that water. Bob, speak to Snorkel Guy. Speak to Snorkel Guy. I don't remember his name, but that's what I know him as. Snorkel Guy. <laughs> okay, funny introduction. They swim really fast. Okay, flirt with him. Go on. Oh no, is that his wife? I hope not. Oh, he's like, nah, I'm not having any of that. <laughs> you know, it's Valentine's Day. Bob can have a secret romance going on. It's all right. <gasps> no, snorkel guy, come back. Snorkel guy, snorkel guy, come back. Where's he gone? I don't even know his name. <laughs> no, 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 snorkel guy, come back. Come back, please. I'm sorry I offended you. Please, snorkel guy, come back. Snorkel eyes gone. I'm mad. Right, I think we need to go and get food, otherwise Eliza, she gonna die. And we're not here for that. Right, I'm going to sand my shoe now. And I wanna get to I think the Japanese stall. I don't know where it is though. Okay, so I want Bob to go and experience the cuisine of the city. Because I want him to cook something I don't know, kind of special at the dinner party. I'm not really sure what to put on the menu. I want to show that we're really rich and we have a lot of money and we're not afraid to spend that money. That's why we've got a golden tiny home. And yeah, I want to get food that really shows that. I mean, we could get ramen, but I don't really care. We get nigiri or we could get pufferfish nigiri. I mean, that that's expensive. That shows how wealthy we are. Oh, he's he's having a bit of bother with those, yeah. Yeah, you need to get the finger dexterity, you know? I mean, having bad coordination, I relate to that a lot, mate. That way he now sort of knows how to cook better food, and it means we can just, you know, really entertain the good guests at our dinner party. Um, she knows a lot, but I think she needs to speak to more people. <gasps> Look, there's Alice. Hi, um be friendly to her okay so i moved love day to tomorrow and now i've got romantic spirit give flowers grand meal watch romantic tv go on a date and there's a dinner party and we're gonna invite snorkel guy which is kind of cute so yeah i mean it starts pretty soon tomorrow maybe we should travel home <laughs> oh look here we are it's our old friend makoa Brag about really, really micro home. This is a new interaction. I like it. Okay. He's pumped. He's like, I've never seen a micro home before. I like it. Oh, Makoa, I need you to cheat on your wife. I know he's married. I know he's married. But Bob, Bob wants to cheat. 
Okay. Oh no, he's good friends with him now. See, the flirting, from my experience with these sims, only seems to go well when they're good friends. So, I mean, unless they're pretty forward. And then, like, Don Lothario, he doesn't mind. But other sims, they mind. He's still not okay with it. He is loyal to his wife. That's commendable. Oh no. Oh no. No, no. She saw. She saw. She saw. Oh. She is mad. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Oh, Eliza, I'm so sorry. Oh, come on. You can have like your cool, not so secret romance going on. <laughs> <gasps> There's romance. Wait, I didn't see that. <laughs> yes, Bob. Oh, I think it's too early for a first kiss. Oh, no. Ah! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. She just sneaks up behind you. I mean, Eliza, you, I know you deserve better. I mean, people give her a lot of hate, but she deserves better than this, you know. I, I think she deserves better. It's fine, because later I'm going to give her the dinner party that she deserves. And it's all going to be so nice. Oh my god, this is cute. Oh my god. Oh my... Oh no, Vlad. <laughs> what is he doing? Vlad. Vlad. Seriously? You, you've got an issue with this? Vlad. Lies... Vlad's bothered by this. Vlad's just jealous because no one's ever going to date him. You know what? That's fine. Oh no! Wait, when did that happen? He's got no romantic relationship with Eliza, like, at all. This is so bad. Oh, she's yelling. Sh she's yelling. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why, but in every save, I always get Bob to cheat on Eliza. I just, I don't know, maybe she kind of deserves it. Oh, she's stomping. I mean, to be honest, when your relationship's this bad, you don't want to be in a tiny home. Literally, like, no wonder she goes outside all the time. Bob, your guests are coming. That means snorkel guy's coming. Oh, oh, what's he doing? He's receiving a gift from someone. He gave a Oh, my God. <laughs> he gave him a gift oh my god this is so cute i ship it <laughs> i'm fine <laughs> okay i think you need to go can you stop going through my fridge woman that is like rude that's like the height of rudeness yeah we'll get a party size serving i don't know if that's bad we got a good stove okay we're gonna cook some good old pufferfish nigiri on a bad quality stove might not go so great um yeah <laughs> i'm feeling a bit sour about the whole valentine's day thing and i don't know having a horrible pufferfish dinner party seems like a lot of fun to me oh she's just she's struggling with chopsticks it's <laughs> fine i was getting kind of scared then many unbearable hours later okay <gasps> what who died? Who died? How? How? Who died? How? Who died? Oh no, I didn't pause my game. <gasps> Alice! Alice died! Does she die from the Murphy bed? Or does she die from... Does it say how she died? Or does she die from the pufferfish? Wait, how did she die? <gasps> no, two of them died! <gasps> Wait, how did they die? Two of them died. Wait. <gasps> <laughs> what if I'm the monster <laughs> that's been here all along? Oh. Oh. Wow. So, you know when I said earlier, Eliza Pancakes will get the party she deserves? Eliza Pancakes is getting the party she deserves. <laughs> oh, doesn't look so good now, does it, hon? Well, happy Valentine's Day, Eliza. Happy Love Day. Hope you had fun. <laughs>
<laughs> See? When I said Eliza deserved a better a good love day, this is exactly what I meant. He's laughing! No, he's laughing! He's laughing! He's laughing! <laughs> This is your wife, Bob. Bob, he's laughing. He's clapping his hands. <laughs> this is funny. No, he's actually really happy. I mean, <laughs> this is the whole Sims community right now. Wait, why are you sad? Oh, suddenly you're like, oh yeah, I'm a widow now. <laughs> Losing a true love. Bob, I think that's a lie. Bob, I think that's a lie. <laughs> Enemies to mine. Oh, well, I, I I think I think Eliza Pancakes, this is probably the best thing for you. I mean, can we invite Snorkel Guy round? Aww. Isn't this nice? Oh, Eliza, I love this for you. Earlier I said in cast that that was her best form. I'm pretty sure that is her best form. Okay, girl. I mean, we could invite Snorkel Guy around, but we will never get married to him. He's just, we're just sad, but I mean, you know what, Bob? I think you did quite well out of Valentine's Day. Um, you know what? I hate Valentine's Day and I definitely had fun celebrating Valentine's Day. Um, so yeah, I'm probably gonna go now. I, I don't know what this video is. I'm sorry. <laughs> so I'm gonna go now. Please don't forget to like and comment and subscribe and I hope you have a really good day and I will see you guys in my next video.